Help from across the country is pouring in. However, local authorities say more help is needed than is locally available. Our team coverage continues with CBS 4's Joan Murray. She's live in Fort Lauderdale with what's being done here in South Florida. Joan? Well, this is just one of several Red Cross locations here in South Florida that loaded up today, got ready, and headed out on their way to help the people in Southeast Texas. This is what carries the food. One will carry meat, one will carry vegetables, and one will carry starch. Relief to flood ravaged Texas is on the way, courtesy the Red Cross of South Florida. These empty containers are headed to a staging area in Louisiana, where Red Cross volunteers will fill them with meals to deliver to displaced flood victims. Two of these trucks headed out of Fort Lauderdale for the long journey. A third Red Cross truck from Miami and several more from West Palm Beach are joining the caravan of relief. We get our food. We go out to the site that they tell us, and we take it by step by step. You might have uh, uh, dangerous conditions, and we know that we're going to go into an area that there's dangerous conditions. Search and rescue and swift water response teams that left Miami Sunday are now in South Texas. Dozens of Coast Guard personnel from Florida are there too, and more than 100 officers from Florida's Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission hauling dozens of boats are now helping tens of thousands of stranded residents. There's so much flooding. They say that the flooding area, people that are underwater area is between Boston and New York. It's definitely one of the worst disasters we've seen. And it's still raining, it's still flooding, so they haven't had any, any breaks. There's no food in any of the grocery stores as we've lived through down here in South Florida. It's, you know, we know what it's like. So the best way to help, if you want to help in this situation, is to make a monetary donation. You can get a complete list on our webpage. Also, Red Cross is accepting donations, 1-800-RED-CROSS, or you can go to redcross.org, or also you can text HARVEY90999 to make a $10 donation. Still lots of need at this juncture and they are asking everyone to do what they can to help. In Fort Lauderdale, Joan Murray, CBS 4 News. Joan, thank you. And Neighbors for Neighbors is also helping in the relief effort, supporting Rebuilding Together Houston. Donations can be made by calling 305-597- 4404 or heading to the Neighbors for Neighbors website, neighborsforneighbors.org.